All right, if you have made it this far in our sound trap lesson, congratulations. Uh, there's a couple of things I wanted to show you real quick. Uh, I made a few changes to my voice from the last video. Uh, I did go in, I forgot to actually change it, so I did go in and I uh, voice transformed to the baby. So I think I'm going to do the baby sound. And I also wasn't very happy with the volume. And in the last video, we discovered that if you click this, you can adjust in the effects. If you add an effect, which I've already done right there, um, you can change the volume separately from where you change it here on the screen up here. So I did uh, take the volume up a little bit. It was a little too much. So I'm going to bring it down while I'm in here. Uh, the other thing I want to do just to kind of clean this up, once I put the effect on there, listen to the beginning of it. You can kind of hear um, this. I'm going to cancel or close that now. You can kind of hear this part of their recording in the, the, the loop. And I don't really want that. It's called room noise. I don't want that room noise in there. So I'm going to make the track shorter. And the way I'm going to do that is adjust the start. And it's right there, that little... Uh, symbol right there. I'm going to click it and see how it's circled. I'm going to drag my start to right before I start speaking. Okay, that way it's not got all that room noise before. I'm going to do the same thing with afterwards. I'm going to scoot it back, see where I grabbed it there. And I'm just going to scoot it back to cut off pretty close to after I finish speaking. Okay, that way I don't have that extra sound in there. Now let's just see what we got beginning to end and uh, see how it sounds. I think it needs to be louder. There we go. One more time. Maybe take it up just a little bit more volume-wise. Now, what if, say, you want to do this two times through, right? Because we've got a loop of eight measures. And if you notice up here at the top, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, maybe I want to do it two times, right? Okay. I can go here. And I can, let's see if, ah, it does. Okay, wonderful. So if I grab this little circle right here, this, like, arrow circle, and pull it, guess what happens? It's now a loop of it. Okay, let's listen. Now, 